So, welcome back to Hogwarts. We are starting where we left off. We are going to our flying class and um, hopefully get the broom immediately after so that I can cause... Oh yeah, we... that, that is something I find extremely interesting as well. If you need to do a quest during daytime or nighttime, but it isn't daytime or nighttime, the character just falls down and sleeps, apparently. <laughs> oh wait, let's go over here, of course. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Madame Kugava. Mr. Clothen, your attention please. Sorry, Madame Kugawa. Go. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. Thank you for the We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Hey. Not a fan, I take it? Now, <laughs> let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up, firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! God, I would now, love to be able to fly on turn. a broom. You stupid ratty school broom. I'm probably a pro, right? Up. I am a pro. It's the ancient magic. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Hi, monkey. If you hear my whistle while you're in flight, pull and never ground yourself at once. I try, I try my best. Good. Okay. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. The broom this is a school property. I want them returned in I one piece. Own. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Wouldn't riding a broom hurt your bud? Mm. Could be right about that. This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What have you? Hello. Nice day for a flight. Brilliant. I'm a witch now. I mean, I kind of have been one before, I guess, uh, but now I'm one hundred percent a witch. Could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Camera is a bit wonky when flying here, but look at this! This is beautiful. Dana's delivery service. We have Quidditch. Unfortunately, the game doesn't have any oh, Quidditch. Our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance. Oh, it's a squid. Hello. Ooh. This is rather fun. A Harry Potter game where you can fly and there's no quidditch. Zero out of one hundred. Is Kiki. Oh, I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. Who but are you? Of myself. Everett? We met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class? 
Oh, I see. I see. Uh, yeah, here. Um, I don't know. Ch Chihiro? Right? I don't know if it was the moving castle or... Uh, I think it's the moving castle, right? They have different names here, okay? They have different names. It's a Studio Ghibli movie, at least, that she's talking about. Yeah! Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is that rat flying so quickly? Here's something handy tonight. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. <laughs> now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Plaintiffs and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. And here's the Quidditch field. I mean, at least we can fly over it, right? That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Let's hurry back. And hand in our brooms. Dismount here. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get Yeah, I agree, taxi. King. I agree. Hefty points will be taken. One hundred percent, I'm with you. you for not following my instructions, Mr. Clopton. I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. The twenty sounds a bit, yeah, sounds a As bit. As for you, you do well cheap. to use better judgment in the future. More like thirty nine ninety nine. Chin up. That was some rather good fly. Well, thank you, Missus. Billy. Hello. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. I agree. Yep. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing. You're or right two about if that, King. Broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I'll have to purchase Thank a Thank you for the Loki spillers. You should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll yeah, keep an we eye should out do that. in the sky. Maybe I first need to... Um, buy a broom? Or can I just, like, take it over here? No, doesn't look like it. Apparently, don't have a broom yet. Like, yeah, it sucks that Nintendo has to do DLCs, but at least one Smash Bros. character stage in a couple of dozen new songs is only five euro, uh, five dollar. No, I didn't. Ah, I didn't upgrade. Like, I didn't unlock it yet. We're going broom shopping, indeed. Yes. Can I really not take like anything? Come on, give me a broom, like. I've not forgotten about our library venture. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. 
All right. Tick, tick. I require assistance with a delivery and thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Okay, dear Madam Kogawa, marvelous news that you will be that you will be joining the faculty faculty of Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. So she's new. I dare is dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than our time near Yokohana Harbor, though one never knows. I shall look forward to seeing you soon if you have any questions. In the meantime, please do not hesitate to send me an owl. Warm regards, Matilda Weasley. Please meet me in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. Okay. I don't even know where we're starting now. So let's see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. What is the the room of requirement? Oh, okay. Conjuring spell, what do we have here? Confringo. I think we do Sebastian first. Illegal broom flying, son of a bitch, I'm in. Bevelio. So, Sebastian is teaching me a new spell. And it needs to be day uh, nighttime apparently, and we have fallen asleep again. Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. Um... This way. Enter the secret room with Sebastian. There's a secret passage just here. Remember, it's Sebastian, I'm a vegetarian. Just so you know, don't want to disappoint you. What? Oh, I go alone? What did I go alone? How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. I know Ominous. Met him in our common room. I've noticed he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Of course. Ominous spoke to me about his family when we first met. To say that he has no love lost for them is an understatement. Glad you understand. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to. Away from prying eyes. And even practice otherwise forbidden spells. So is he teaching us the dark arts? Like what? Like the blasting curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. Come in. 
A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Hello, my... Very well. How are you doing, Mide? He's into arson. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? Stick to the target. Best to keep the undercross. Um, 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 where is it? Um, 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 um boom, 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 boom. Expl oh, here. Confringo. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses. But I think you'll find that a Confringo cast travels a bit farther than that of a spell like Incendio. Oh, I see. Nice work. How does it feel? That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. Chris! Hello, there he is. There's the man we've been waiting for. I have to say... I enjoyed that. Hi, how are you doing? Ominous and I practiced Confringo. We singed our eyebrows. I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, homemade pizza something and some about beer. That spell oh. that's addictive. That sounds good. That sounds extremely good. Are you probably Chris or are you another Chris, maybe? <laughs> I'm ready for more. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came He's from. He's the only Chris. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. Haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything... Did she I die? Perhaps when I next head to Felcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. Oh. She could use some cheering up. Uh... I, I'm not, I'm... Just let me know when, and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. Might it have something to do with Victor Rookwood? He didn't mistake you for someone else at all in Hogsmeade, did he? Nothing gets past you. I'll tell you what I can. Rookwood and Ramrock are trying to recover something they think I took from a vault in Gringotts. Gringotts? When were you there? Professor Fig and I wound up there after the dragon attack. There was this port key. A port key? To Gringotts? Well, it's all a bit convoluted. I'm listening. Mm, do we tell him the truth? Uh, you know, he's a fellow Slytherin, and I think he's trustworthy. You must promise can. to keep this between us. I trusted you with knowledge of the secret Undercroft. You can trust me. All right. I hope he can. I hope he isn't I shallow. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Creep, hello. Honestly, I hope you're doing I'm well. not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, Ooh. does it allow you to wield this magic too? It's a I, Patrick. I don't know. I like that. Well, when you do know, tell me. I like that, I've Chris. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, a sus, I suspect Patrick. a bit more time practicing the blasting curses in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. Sure thing. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. Is there like anything... Um... Oh yeah, my gear slots are full again. 
Ah, guys, it looks like we have to sell a bit. And Chris, good that you're here. We were waiting for you. I got you something. You know what that is? Can you see what it is? Just for you. Hello, oh Sebastian. no. Wait. Oh no. You there? I can hear you. Oh, hello, ominous. I was just heading to our common room. I've recognized that voice. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? Oh no. Uh, I think we're honest. Actually, Sebastian brought me there, but he made it perfectly clear. To I'm keep his quiet new about it. That rat. You Ooh. breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. Wow. My headmaster. And I'm not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. What a bitch. He's a... I'm an honest person and he shouldn't fret me. He needn't threaten me. I'm not going to say anything about your undercroft. Why should I trust you? You just betrayed Sebastian. Please, I was trying to defend him. He was clear that this was a secret place and I was to tell no one. He's a good friend. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant... I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough wow, trouble. Wow, what a need your help. big bitch. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Chris, where are you? A vada cadaver, indeed. Is that like would I get cancelled for killing the blind guy? He's like a he's like a big bitch. Um, I need to sell stuff. Um, first. We have a look at this. No, no, no. Um, oh wait, I still have skill points, right? That I... Big B, and what is a small B? Hmm, what is a small B? The Hufflepuff guy that it showed us how to fly is a big B. It uh, is a small B. Uh, dark arts. So let's see. Stupefy has the same effect as a curse on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. We don't know stupefy yet. But. I want that here. Flipendo? Do we know Flipendo yet? I don't think so. Cursed effect remains on an enemy. You're a big bill. Ah, I see. So what about core? I think we should purchase one of these here. How many do I have? Six more. So another spell said successfully Protego books will contribute to ancient magic. We don't vlog. We don't vlog. Yeah, that here sounds good. You should have flipped your middle finger to him. <laughs> Successfully evading an unblockable attack. Well, I'm rolling around the entire time, so. Stupefy. Stupefy. Do I know Stupefy yet? Where's Chris when you need him? He did go away. From a requirement. A doer's potion make you inv invulnerable and deflect projectiles. Attack bag. Um, 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 um. Spells. <sighs> that sounds good. 
Confringo impacts produce fury, fury bolts that seek enemy targets. Oh, that's cool. Get that. Uh, we keep these two for now, I guess. Um, so we need to... Get to Hogsmeade. And sell a bit. And we have a side quest here. Um, 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 wait. There we go. Chopping onions! Chopping onions. But Chris isn't here. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. First we sell stuff. First we do sell a lot of stuff here. Oh, this is legendary as well. Oh. Um, Voyager garb, and that's a co. Those are glasses. But I think, like, legendary is the highest tier, I suppose. Right. Unidentified head item. I right, we don't sell that yet. Mm. Keep it like that for now. So what oh, potion recipes? Um I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Looks like you can upgrade them. Yes, 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 yes. Chris, your battery. Oh no. Chris, Hello, I need Mr. you right now. You need help with the delivery? You yes, requested I do. something. A capable student last such time. as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence which you order so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. That sounded sus. Like for real. Oh, I wouldn't mind looking at your potion... You know, your potion... Collection one day. Hey? Don't tell me that didn't sound sus. So, how far are we away? Oh, that's that's a bit... By the looks of it. That is a bit. A bit, bit, bit. Um. Time to fast travel. I think on Chris is gone again. Are we? Yep, on another adventure we are. Being an officer of the law in a quiet village like Hogsmeade is a pleasant job, I'd say. How do I get these bitches without falling down here? Oh. I blew up that, um, wolf in. Just saying. <laughs> okay, that's pretty, like, easy now. 
honestly. So I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder how many um, mongrel fur do I have? Should be in my inventory, right? Like, can I have only like a maximum of five of each? No, no. Oh look, I have 84 of these here, so that doesn't seem to be any cap, maybe 99 or something like that, but... I can farm as much as I want by the looks of it. That's nice. Ooh, what do we have here? Oh yeah, the spiders, of course. Ouch. 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 There we go. Spinner! Oh, she's not dead yet. There we go. Not my fault you're a deadly great spider. Yeah, exactly. I'm not saying you deserve death, but you are really not. Mm -mm. Complete dueling thieves. I wonder if there are werewolves in the game. That would be interesting. What do you think, Nick? With some werewolves in the Forbidden Forest? Nope. Ow! What do we have there? Why is it glowing? Oh. Ah, this one here. Yeah, I remember this place. I will bite you on the neck. Chris, you're back! Hello, hello, hello. Chris, do you have, like, good battery life right now? Are you charging your phone? Are you here with us? Isn't there another one? Or is that down by the river? Probably not a... not a wolfie. It's more like a... A toad? The duck bog, yeah. Hey man, can you come down here? You're charging right now, 1%, okay. You're getting stronger and stronger and stronger. You can't let you them, they're like too fat for me. You can't live without your phone. Uh, oh, that's the village, I see. Okay. Okay, okay. Are these zombies? I threw a gravestone at the zombie, and apparently... Inferi must be struck with fire spells to make them vulnerable to other attacks. Visit the collection menu to learn about any weaknesses. Okay. I see. Okay. I, I'm not sure they, like, you know... Ooh. 
So there are more around me. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh -oh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, okay, I got this, I got this, I got this. Oh wow, more no, coming, more, no. okay, okay. Hey man. Woo! Okay. Don't mind me, just blowing up the dead. It's a zombie without tea. Yeah. It's a pretty zombie without tea. Indeed. XP farming the dead indeed. Rebellion. Is there like anything here? What is that, an egg? Stench of the dead. Oh, it's like a... A skull. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Fast travel point here. A Merlin trial. A Merlin trial here. Let me quickly see. I don't know what happened. Pavelio. Maybe I will find that out one day. That Pippin should have been here by now. Oh, is that her? Madame Luang, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have your brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. Here are the potions you requested. You she's think it's also, so like, she's the small bee. I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. What? Drink no, it. she's a big bitch. What the heck? Ah. Seems simple enough. I'll do it. I should think so. Drink an invisibility potion. I mean, it shouldn't, like, blow me up, right? Give it to me, lady. Oh, I need to drink, drink it. Um. Um. Rebellion. Uh, where do I... Do that again. Uh, see her recipes in it. Oh. Is that thing blowing up now? Uh... How... How do I do that again? Um... Wait... Inventory. So, we have... Notes, resources... Leech juice? How do I... Where are my potions? Um No I probably drunk them all yeah Essentials Basic cast Value, Protego. I can make myself invisible. Oh. Oh, I can do that? I didn't know. 
I learned new things. Um, but, but, but... Revelio. Oh. Invisibility potion. It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? Ha! <laughs> Not a chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us have to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. We're always like our smile, our our face expressions, always that of a very like a mm, fuck you. I'm just smiling through it, you know. You self-absorbing bitch. Do you get to choose your full name in it? Yes, you do. You do indeed. You have a sudden urge to eat garlic bread. Billet, you should stay here. We're gonna eat a onion very soon. <sighs> very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. What do you have for sale? What are we looking for today? I'm not buying anything from you. <sighs> Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. So do I like not get anything from you now? What the heck is that? No trolls, beware spiders. Rebellion. Hmm. The barkeep in Cambridge keeps a stock of ginger root handy to fend off his customers' nausea and keep them imbibing a bit longer. Hmm. Drinking everything here. Mmm. Yum, 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 yum. So. Okay. Uh, third one, maybe. It's like a place right out of a storybook. <gasps> Rebellion. The locals call this the, the tilted house due to the old angle at which it sits wrapped in the roots of the overhanging tree. Should be level 20 now, eh? Well, that's nice. Or maybe I'm not. Got some snackies. Ah, oh, there it is. Just some sickles. Ah, I think I found my Merlin's. Um, can I jump over this? Oh, oh, oh. Revelia. So. When you're here, where's the rest of you? Where do I bring you? So Chris, are you with me? Are you ready to do the thing? <laughs> the onion awaits. Regal Black. Or oh, is that a, a wand handle? Revelio. This is all so damn cozy. The wizarding world needs honey for their tea as much as the Maga world does. Oh man, that looks dangerous over there. But it's probably a cave. If I would have to take a guess. The onion awaits, Chris. We're all rooting for you here. Rebellion. Competitive school rope. There seems to be something down here. 27 sickles. It's really not a lot, I guess. What one do I have? That is a good question. Um, I... Yeah. 
Um, can I see that one? What is it? It's a it's a ebony dragon heart string. Yeah, it's an ebony wood type. The core is made of dragon heart string. It's very solid and it has eleven inches. And you get some music, of course. Mm, that's. I mean, honestly, I haven't. I haven't seen a single one handle that I didn't like yet. I have to admit, like they they looked all really really nice. I think that is probably probably my least favorite. But they're really really cool. Let's stick with that one for now. I uh, recently found a really nice band, actually, by accident, so they're relatively unknown, I have seen, so let me see. Um, they're called Anave. And the song was called Not Enough. Let me get you the link. Very, very random come up on Spotify for me. Enjoy. I hope you like them. So is Chris here now or nah? I think Chris van vanished again. So, um, you know, while we're in the water, I can also... Uh, hello? I didn't know that we can now dive. Chris went to buy milk, apparently. So... I hope we're not dying now. Don't do this at home when you're alone, kids. Don't dive. Oh yeah, it seems to be some sort of dungeon. Let's see. And never come back with the milk. Hi, Chris. Um, I'm, I'm out here. Can we, like, you know, this is like, hello. I'm not fat or anything. I like, I, I fit perfectly in here. Oh, I see. Revenia. Um, Chris, how are you doing, by the way? What's going on? Dusky wool scarf. Loose and black and white pinstripe scarf. Huh? I think that ain't too bad. Nothing else in here? Look at the little froggies. They're really cute. doing yeah I know I know Let me come here, here. you're right no come here oh he still loves me okay just wanted to have a look at you <sighs> Glenn is it you Reaper, take care of yourself. Enjoy your Saturday night. Whatever you're doing. I hope it's going to be a good one. Thanks for being here. If you'd like, we see us tomorrow for ARG. Neko will be, to will be there too, I heard. You're doing good. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, look at the sheep. So, I need to return to Perry Pippin, but Chris, now that you're here... Delicious frog... Are you... are you for real? Well, you guys know, it's been like two and a half years since Chris joined the community. And I believe we still don't know where Chris is actually from, which is absolutely fine. But since he rooted for France in the last World Cup, and he's now telling me that he likes rock, I believe he's from France. Did you know it's not the size of the one, it's the magic behind it. 
Kiwi! You're very damn right about that. It's about what the wand can do. Not the size of the wand. True words have never been more truer. Kiwi, I hope you're doing well. No, I think it's... No, it's... it's Kibler. Kibli? Kibli. It's onion time. You brought bread? I brought an onion, Billif. Um, let's go. Something like that. I promised... Um, yeah, I did promise something. Kinda. So yesterday, no, on, on Tuesday, Mr. Chris here re re redeemed the onion redeem. And uh, no one believes me that I do eat onion for funsies. Because they're like healthy, and every time I feel like under the weather, like you know something is coming up, like a like a flu or something. I haven't been sick in like six years, but um, whenever I feel under the weather, it's time for an onion. And like people don't really believe me that I just eat that, you know. I mean, it is spicy. It's a good kind of spice. It's not an apple, but... Ooh. But it's good, you know? <laughs> uh, Chris, you redeemed that. You wanted to see that. You're helping me, um, staying healthy. <laughs> it's good, says Dana, as she's crying. No, actually, it's not that terrible. Fry it next time, makes an onion ring. Oh, I love onion rings. I love onion rings. Unfortunately, I've never done onion rings myself. Seems suspicious to you. Oh. The trick is, it is actually cake that looks like an onion. Ooh. It gives you the... You know, the, the feeling in your nose. And your throat. I mean, Nyako, you can come over and try something. Exactly, Bill, exactly. Maybe... Ugh. Well, I have to admit, I never eat that much in one go. It's more like over the, over the course of like five minutes. What does onion taste like? I don't know what does onion taste like. You hate spicy sweets? Oh, sweat. Oh. Oh. Got it now. The spicy sweats. When you eat the good chili. And you know that tomorrow won't be a good day. Sweet sweats. All the sweet sweats. If it is the right subjectively amount of spicy. The problem now is that I will have the onion burps. You know, like the... Like... The onion. <sighs> but actually, like, it's disinfecting the entire throat and everything is like... You know what I mean? 
Cut the onion, deep the onion in beer batter and fry it. We only have an air fryer though. I will have to find out if I can find a recipe for air frying onion rings. I love onion rings. Couldn't eat the onion, yeah. It's like, let's laugh. <laughs> Woo. I have a runny nose. Should I eat a slice of raw onion? I don't get the red ones. Oh. The last one is getting my throat. What the heck is Neko doing over there? Who is that? <laughs> oh, I see. Okay. I was like, what the heck is she doing over there? With tomato, I'm like... I am a bit red, I have to admit. Like, I mean, I mean, I mean at least you kind of know it's a real onion now, right? But I don't... I, I cannot, like, fake crying. <laughs> I'm not that much of a good actor, actress. With tomato and some rajika, it goes good, but raw like this, well, I have respect for you. Just don't speak to anyone five meters in front. I wasn't on your agenda today. Dana, I'm red. Yeah, I, uh, yes, I am. Whew. Yes, I ate an onion. But yeah, that's... I just don't, like, I usually don't eat it in a whole go-go. More like over, like, let's say, 10 minutes. <sighs> I'm fine. You could maybe, if you like, bring me my water. It's in the, in your room. It's on the couch. <laughs> That would be nice. That would be really nice. But yeah, again, I can only recommend if you're feeling under the weather, treat yourself to like a quarter or like even like a an eight of an onion. Uh, organic though and red, ideally. Water is good, yeah. I am. I just finished my cacao. I did drink the milk. It's gone. It wasn't a whole ass onion. It was half an onion. But, yeah. Usually we make like a, a salad every day. You know, like tomato salad is very popular here. And we put onions in it. and Or like when we... When we make dinner or lunch, pasta, mm. they always Seems have a onions. Enough little place. And, um, onions are key. I still don't know where to bring that. <laughs> Do you want a kiss? No. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna sting you all night. <laughs> Dana, you regret it, Chris? Or do I regret it? No, I don't regret it. If you go in, come at your own hazard. Yeah. Disgusting. Disgusting.
onions are super nice, just as garlic. Um, so. You don't like them raw. I prefer them in, um, like pasta as well, but. You know, that's the deal. Um, yeah, that's the deal for the, for the good effects. I don't know where to put this bauble. I need to find where to put the ball. And you need to go over the... Thank you. Potion recipe book. Sugar snap piece. Rebellion. What's that? Ah. Oh. Okay, another item that I need to put into the room of requirement, I believe. And what is that? Father, I hope you find this little and that you won't be cross with me when you do. I must go with this. I must go through with this hunt. You and mother require the food. I will return in a day or two. Safe as always. With plenty of meat, then you would see that these beasts are not possessed by dark magic as you claim rest easy i shall return arnold they make a very satisfying snap when you bend them in half that is fair enough Beatrice, a week has passed and Arnold has yet to return. I must find him. Should he return before I do, blessed day. Both of you wait here for me. Do not attempt to find me. How I, how I hope that nothing has happened to our boy and that our fears concerning the beasts affected by dark magic are as unwarranted as he claims. Demo. Rebellion. This looks like the Rapunzel Tower. It's a bit small maybe, but... So where are we right now on the map? Mm. While we're here, I could quickly get that fast travel point in. Oh look, it's a toad. <gasps> what do we have here? Stonehenge? Pavilion. Oh, sickles. Wow, two sickles. <gasps> Is that a troll over there? Okay. I believe. I'm like oh. I wait I I I I I Akio actually we put on here and Expelliarmus we put on here Expelliarmus Okay it's pretty much has the same effect I want to check out that troll, but I also don't. Why are you shaking your boards, Belith? Should we give it a go? Oh, look at that. Like, he's a... 
Level 31. Uh oh. Uh oh. I think that's a bit out of my league. Oh. Ooh! 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 Oh wow, that was my special attack. That that's a lot of damage. Okay, okay, well, goodbye, my lover. Bye, my friend. Why aren't, why aren't you shaking your balls? Yeah, why are you shaking your balls, Lisa? I don't oh. think that is my time to shine right now. <laughs> run, Donna, run. Maybe I can scare him away with my onion breath. You can't Rebellion. imagine how inconvenient travel Hello. was before I invented flu powder. What is it? What's wrong? Goblins! That's what. Radrocks lot. Nasty creatures. Ambush me, they did. Nothing safe anymore. I need a little something. Something to protect me if I run into them again. Maxima potion. That would do it. I don't have any of that. Perhaps you could try in Hogsmeade, or one of the hamlets. And get extorted by the Ashwinders? No, thank you. <sighs> if you won't help me... He's asking a fifth-year student. Like, dude, you're oh, like a grown-ass man in your 40s. Uh, where the heck are we here? Uh, I think I... Oh, wow. This is really, like... Wow, okay, okay. Um, it was Hogsmeade where I did get the quest, right? Yes. Not a charity, I'm not a charity, man. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Dum, 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 dum. Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. I delivered the potions to Fatima Luang. Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? She was a bitch. I can see why you didn't want to go. She was quite cantankerous. I do truly appreciate your help. And at least it's done with. Delivering those potions was a bit more work than I'd expected. I'd like an additional fee. I suppose that's business for you. Very well, I shall increase your pay, but I'm not at all pleased about it. By the way, I found this book of potion recipes in Cambridge. Might it be useful to you? Is this Fatima's recipe book? Oh, I had no idea it was hers. Some things are secret amongst potioneers. I shall no. return it to her immediately. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know about that. Bye. Bye. I don't listen to anyone. I. I think it's amazing. Follow the butterflies. It's like follow the spiders, right? Just butterflies this time. Hello. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. to go into the forest pardon me but were you saying something oh hello talking to myself i'm clementine willetsy charmed i was musing on the precious butterflies i see near the edge of the forest whenever i come near they fly off into it when i was at hogwarts we truly were forbidden from entering the forest 
told horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. It's silly, but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly... Uh, I mean, Could yeah, you, of course. you want me to follow the butterflies? I do, yes, if you wouldn't mind. As I feel you, my backlog is getting longer and longer and longer. Can we see Professor Garlic? I mean, for class? Very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find me right around here. I hope to see you soon. Your backlog got shorter. Mine gets every, like, you know, gets longer every Don't month when the PlayStation Plus is getting us more nice place. games. Rebellion. Wands of a variety of woods and all manner of flexibility, each processing one of three magical cores, choose their owners in this cozy clutter trap run by the amiable and knowledgeable Gerwald Ollivander. In the profession of Wandcraft since 300 AD to BC, the Ollivander family are considered the best wand makers in Britain, if not the world. Professor Garlic, yes indeed. Rebellion. Professor Garlic is our biology... Uh, not biology, her herbology teacher. Hmm, find the butterflies? Is it that's where it's leading me now? Yeah. You know where we go though, foot. Because we can. Because we want to admire this absolutely stunning game. No, it's garlic. It is indeed garlic. Rebellion. Let's get us some shrooms. Oh no. Uh oh. I got the charger here. Hmm. What is that? God, look at this. This is so damn beautiful. I want the next Witcher game to look like that, for real. Mm. Read something in the game with a British accent. Okay. We can do that. Um... Rebellion. We can do that when I come across something nice in a bit. Whee! Oh, there's more over there. By the looks of it. And along with all the fishies. I also get a fringed forest lock scarf. Well, let's see, might get an answer about these butterflies. That's pretty. That is extremely pretty. I like their colors. Look at all those chickens. Hello. 
Are you sure that it is my mother and not an intruder having a party downstairs? <gasps> Ooh. Oh well, look what we have here. Got a trophy for that. I don't really know what I actually did. I've been down there, they are trying on carnival costumes. Well, Andrea is which one? My mother or the friend Andrea? Return to Miss Williatsy. Revelia. The friend. Ah, oh, I see, I see. It's the least an intruder could do, to be fair. <laughs> Subscribe to me, you intruder, yes. I ran out of water. Can you give me more water? That would be super kind. Mama Dana is not called Mama Dana. Yeah, my mama's name is Andrea and her friend is also called Andrea. So there's like double trouble downstairs right now. And with Carnival being like in full force at the moment here. Getting uh, Neku to see a carnival's carnival parade on Monday. It's gonna be a cultural shock. Um, she was in Hogsmeade, right? Not Dana Senior. Here. Um. Let's go. I'm not Dana Junior. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Uh, right, she was in the. Oh, please tell me you have an answer for me about the silver butterflies. Luck. I do. I actually do. Hello, Miss Wallace. Well, what happened? Did you find them? They led me into the forest and revealed a treasure. Oh, how lovely! I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. She oh, is so one cute. Day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. Down Today, Andrea and I'm Dana. Happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see. Should I dare? All right. Completed quest. Follow the butterflies. There's another side mission in here. And okay, yeah, it's um a broom <coughs> flying mission, uh, side mission, by oh, the looks of it. Face. Wonderful. Rebellion. Take that now. Is that a page there up there? Looks like it. And but there's also something else. There we go. Oh yeah, so British. Run by the amiable Arby Weakers, the shop sells all manner of wizarding sporting goods, including the latest bro models. Gossip around town is that Arby himself is working on a number of broom enhancements. Alicia was in spiders, right? Spinwitch's sporting needs. The guide page. Okay, if you want Quidditch, what team player would you be? Correct answer is the CK. Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't know, Juan. I'm, I'm more like of a, you know, I'm a keeper. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. I want Sounds a broom. Like the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. I want Thank a broom. You. Would you like to give me a broom? What are we looking for today? The perfect broom for those with a fiery temperament. A broom enchanted to celebrate your particular Hogwarts house pride. 
finely crafted from ash, this broom is built for stability. A stylish broom with a light touch, quite literally. A comfortable and speedy broom with a unique woven design. It's the onion. It takes two. To, it takes two to to speak perfectly. Yes, 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 yes. That item is of the highest quality. Hmm. So it's just about the looks, by the looks of it. Uh huh. Uh, that's not pretty. Is there like a lantern on it? Uh, I mean, it's kind of like. That item is of the highest. Oh, quality. they all have lanterns on. No, that one doesn't. I'm forgetting to pronounce the T's. Yo, Nako. Would she be so kind and bring me Bob War? Has anyone watched Arcane League of Legends? We did start it. Nako and I did start it. Um, I, we, I fell asleep at episode 6, I believe. Acharya, hello! Dana is a Slytherin, I am. I am. Yeah, I don't... I Nako. Honey. Please. I need water. I run dry. I, I don't have any more water. Can you bring me a bowl of water? A bowl of water? It's like... It's like dry, you know? Like dry, dry. Like, dry. Like, you know, dry. There's nothing coming out. I need a new bowl of water. <laughs> Up in north, a new car, so we don't use the latte. I pronounce mirror correctly. How you pronounce mirror correctly? Is it like... Can you take a mirror? They look in the mirror. What in it? Uh, what did I want? That item is of the highest quality. Hmm. I don't like that one. I also don't like that one. I am not sure about that lantern. It's kind of cool, but also also really not. That item is of the highest quality. I think I like the first one most because it has the um I take that one. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Nice doing business with you. I once heard someone say the dog camouflaged camouflage at floor instead of the dog is camouflaged on the floor. I wonder. Does she not have her sound on? Is she like ignoring me? Swirling things. I can hear you, that's nice. Thank you, you are you're a magnificent honey or honey tree honey tree uh, trees. Um. Mm. Mm. Thanks for stopping by. Miro. Nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice Miro. brooms in Kagawa's class. They all have their limitations. Will you take a look you in the mirror? Flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements. Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. Hello, I'm As it I'm happens, in. another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. Screw the main quest. You I'm in. you compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Yes. That sounds intriguing. No questions. We'll see what I can do. Need Thank to be asked. You. It'll be worth your while. 
If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. My baby Once has just pulled Imelda's all time, my clean washing sure out the basket, sat on it, then fought it with all his might. <laughs> nice. Revelio. Can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Speak with the Melorays at the Quidditch pitch. All right. Where was that flying page? There was a flying page. I remember seeing one. Oh, ooh, that's that looks there. It is that looked a bit dangerous. That like hurting. Oh. Then when I called him out, he looked at me, smiled, and shook his head. <laughs> it's cute. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Uh, so where was Rebellion. that? There it is. There it is. So. We need to go to the Quidditch field. Hello, doggy. Hope you're doing well. Where's the water girl, right? Mm. You know what? We go there by foot again. That's a bit, I know, but... This is, like, one of the games I would easily go by foot non-stop. Kids will be kids. You have entered an area that allows flight. Press R1 and then equip the broom. Woohoo! Okay, maybe we're not going there. We're flying. Hello! I, I absolutely love kids, yeah. <clears throat> I love them. Oops. <laughs> Any kids? Nope. Nope. <laughs> um, hello. Don't want to fly, no, definitely not. It's not a good idea. Um, I wonder how can I like you can't enter while mounted? I wonder, can I like can I like go on here? Like, whoops, yeah, that's what I wanted. Okay, this is like closed. I see, I see. Is this closed too? No. But. But, but, but. Um, that was Protego. Revelio, Stupefy. Can I like stun? Hmm, I don't know. Okay, so they're like doing stuff with dragons here. Letting the dragon fly, and I'm like, okay, they don't have colliders. Too bad. Too bad. So, Quidditch field. If it isn't Slytherin's newest broom talent. How am I breaking? Huh. I see. Hello, Melda. 
Albi Weeks sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you Oh, who? Yeah, I remember. You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you? Yes, you bitch Everyone you are. Knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You can't be what passes for Slytherin these days. Pfft, ragged old hats dropping at standards. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Slytherin. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I need to take a look at that. The room is now a danger zone. Oh. Oh. We need to take a look at that real quick. <laughs> yep. Yep. That's... That's... I guess the biggest problem actually is it is the bad room. I have to admit, when flying, I don't, I don't really, and, uh, yeah, I don't really know why. It's like stopping on stop. This is rather fun. <laughs> now that's more like it. But I think we're doing okay, yeah. This is so awesome. Is this is the finish line. I remember the golden rings from Harry Potter 2. The gold rings make you go faster. It's cool that they put that element in the in the game. It's cool that they added flying, even though there's no Quidditch. The music sounds a bit Star Warsy. <laughs> yes. I'm your wizard father. So was that good or not? Uh, that's not... Y you must have cheated, you... Uh, fine. You won. Uh, don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible. But you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Hmm... Uh. Challenge accepted, then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. But don't get your hopes up. The next course near Irondale offers a much tougher challenge. Yeah, you're you right. I should have taken that. By racing this course again. Just check in at the podium, where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an drop the broom. for weeks. Broom drop. It's not mic drop, it's the broom drop. Return to the podium to challenge other racers and advance. Something, something. 
Okay. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fed. Hmm. Maybe oh, I get a better boom at one point and then I can become number one. That would be, that would be kinda like nice. Can I revelio? I can revelio well on you, okay. What is that? Ah, that's kinda nice that you see the um Mom said it's my turn to read the broom, insert eyes. But we didn't learn how to tame a beast yet, so... You guys down here. This is pointless. Oh, I see, I see. Lyondale's not half as talented. Allow me to put you out of your misery. Let me open. Come out before I find you. What was that? I'm sure it'd be harder to kill a moose. It isn't Nora Treadwell's guardian angel. <laughs> Incendio! Oh, that's clever! Death, say one of my own! Is this your best? Ouch! This place looks very British, very wet. Oh, there's another one? Or where would that guy be? The perfect weather to fight in. Perfect British weather to fight in. See here. Can I like, like... Revelia. No, 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 no. So you are a student, probably like 15 year old, and you're killing people. Yep, that supersonic fart must have taken it out of the wee boy, so I will go and try and settle him to sleep. Do that as a an um yeah, maybe maybe you come back if you like. If not, enjoy. No, Unite. Oh, it's going to be a good one. Take care of yourself. And the baby. Woo! Hello. It's what you've done to helpless beasts. Jeffrey Dama has nothing on this 40, 15 year old. Unidentified neck item. I really need to get to the room of requirements. Um, uh, maybe we're doing that. Maybe we are. Uh, I'm not dying. We quickly return to Albi and then we go and wait. There's a Merlin Let's trial see what's here. Up your sleeve this time, Merlin. And um... oh, I don't have any more Mellow Sweet. Revelia. And then we do the main quest with the room of requirement so that we get these out of uh, see I knew that there was something up with those Are 
Okay, the last you are. So I need two more trials and then my inventory grows a bit or I can armor it with skills? No, I think I my inventory grows. Well, we my inventory grows. Ah, uh, Espion and Amrion. That's such a cute emote indeed. One is Neko, the other one is me. Well, Amrion is Neko. And uh, Espion is me. Twins games, hello. Yesterday when I was playing this, my character glitched and I had four arms. I wish I could have kept that, but uh, it'd be normal mode. I could have been the most powerful wizard ever. You could have like a... Um, you could have like a, a wand and all... Like in, you know, in each arm, like in each hand, if you had four arms, four, four hands... Damn, more arm for the winds. Four arms require... Four ones, indeed. Imagine that. You would have been the most powerful wizard, wizard oh, indeed, if, if Lord Volamer would have just thought, thought about that. He could have easily grown a couple of arms and boom. Hogsmeade, here I come. Revelia. Imagine that. Oh, you're back! With something to report, I am. Wizard gains indeed. Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent and is wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. <laughs> I will say that I it bet. tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Mm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Sounds good. Hmm. So, Can upgrade means more power to my broom, I hope, so... To speed. That is another side quest in the books so um we quickly have a look at our gear and we quickly sell stuff and then we go to the main quest with the room of requirements handware oh yeah oh yeah neckwear um nope it's pretty much the same level 21 so we keep that for now. Mm, okay, okay. Um. Um, um, um. What are we looking for today? We are selling stuff. That goes. That goes. We keep that. Just Thanks for, for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Just in case. So, Hogwarts, Room of Requirements, is that here? Uh, let's go. Your character always looks sleepy, I know. She always looks a bit, like, annoyed by everyone, in my opinion. Like, she's, like, always, like, she's always having that smirk. If you know what I mean. She's always, like, hmm... Revelio. You did the last mission this morning, nice. So I believe you enjoyed the game, that's nice. That is very, very good. Are you, um... Like, what house are you? Are you a fellow Slytherin? It was a fun game when it wasn't glitching or laggy. Miss Dogan! Mm. 
the bitch face. You were a griffin, though, I gotcha. Professor Weasley? Well, my best friend is a Gryffindor, so... <sighs> welcome in. Away from prying True eyes. of my best friend. Oops. I gotcha. Yeah, I thought about replaying as well, to be honest. Me, the I am I'm really curious about like all the other quests the other here. houses get. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. The game is Shall amazing. We? It's amazing. You, Professor. Oh, nice. This is the room of requirement. It only appears when one is in real need. It like really looks like in the movies. A student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If Revelia, I don't this is nice. to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. We can all get yeah, once. That would be awesome. Deep. You must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. <sighs> There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. We can just blow it up. Hmm. This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs. Bring open. me back to life. Blended. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Okay, uh, where is it? It's that here, right? Excellent work. You'll note that you are now Rebellion. in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? Well, there's something on the floor here. Maybe it's from him. Is that hey, I waited for you My here for. Old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. Oh no, she lost. She found her old Can't school bag. It's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. Oh, <gasps> wow. Okay. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Are you like that lost painting Leo did from Cade? Draw me like one of your French girls? Maybe. Take you. Hello. Where do I take you? There's nothing. There's nothing on top there. Uh. Oh wait. Um. Mm, there we go. Are you related to Medusa? Oi! Revelia. Okay. Hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop them! Hello! Oh. Oh. 
Oh no! Are you good? I don't know. You forgot the lamb sauce. Bit of fan of the room though. Thought I needed a bath. Cheeky thing. Well, maybe you needed to pee. Someone apparently also needed some tools. Oh, that is pretty. It's very romantic. Vivelio. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? I like how this spell has been used on chairs and only chairs so far. Just big conventionally places, piles of chairs. Conveniently play, yep, yep. Conveniently places, just, you know, it's probably the room where, you know, they didn't know where to put things. All the chairs they got. What was that? Oh, hello. Was that a golden snitch? Oh, it's a snitch. I thought it was one of the Perhaps keys. you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> the source is forbidden. Revelia. How do we get over there? Hmm. Oh. Like that, I guess. Maybe. No? Is there anything else that I can climb on? Maybe from the other side? Hmm... Doesn't look very climbable to me either. Are we sure we cannot go over here? Hmm. That's poopy. You bought a jump rope. You're now jumping even more. Yeah. Thank you for the logies, Miss Dogen. Well, the snitch is over there. But I'm here. Bothers me. Hmm. Revelio. <laughs> Weird. Weird. I'll leave that alone for now. Even though it bothers me. I hope that house elf can find us in here. Puzzling puzzle, 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 puzzle. puzzles, right? Steal all of those trophies so you look like you accomplished a lot. <laughs> oh, hello! Yikes! Careful! Huh? Oh, Deke. there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. <sighs> Hello. Right, bit of right. We've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed, 
Deke, cheers. Deke, it's honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Hey, Yona! Once trapped upon it by accident, Hello. if ever. Deep seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. How are you doing, Ayona? Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the <laughs> rest. This control indeed. Oh, I don't like to read that. You've given yourself quite a canvas to work with. But fine and always hungry sounds okay. Like that sounds me. I look forward to seeing kinda what you do with the space. Ah. And it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. I hope you are like Excellent. most of the time it can fine and hungry. Unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. Oh, nice. You have unlocked the desk of description. Use it to reveal the magic properties of any un unidentified gear that you have collected. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Pavelio. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Okay, another spell. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase. I have a lot them. of the Moonstone. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm. Quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plots and brew potions in class. Uh, conjure a potting table. Uh, that here, right? Um... 
Thank you. Unlock by completing the elf, the knapsack, and the loom. Well, I have a desk of description, right? Oh. Brewing potions, brewing potions, brewing potions. Uh, I think that's all the same, right? Yeah. Oh, like, just put it down. Um, interesting, interesting. Change color. Oh. Well, we give it a nice black, because why not? Dana will be learning to massage later. My boss felt my neck muscles and said they were like stones. So if Dana gets good, I will hire her out. I've actually been in a basketball team between 3rd and 7th grade. I had to leave because school got way too time intensive, intensive and our coach wanted training 3 times per week. 3 hours each. That was just way too much. Having too little time sucks. This is why I stopped ping pong. Um, and I need a potting table. I see. in lag again well done you can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants presuming of course you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds I can even cast craft furniture statues oh, look at that Derek Hall statue what the heck is that Oh, hello! It's a, oh my god, is it a dodo? Is it a dodo stand? Oh no, we got the dodo! Guys, we have a dodo statue. How cool is that? Look at my dodo! Come on. Can I, like, not put it... No? Can I put it here? I don't need to play with it, I just want to have, have it placed somewhere. Why would you not like... <sighs> Can I place it here? Hmm. We place it here then. Bam. My dodo statue is here. I did get that dodo from Ark, yep. What is that? It's an Argy. You see? Yo, are you munching on an apple over there? And are you like, hey, this is my floor? You can wipe that off, man. Wall hangings. Quidditch board. Oh. Nah. Flower box. Nah. Rugs. Don't have any rugs yet. Decorations. Mm, frog choir stand. Scientific clog. Botanical clog. Electric clog. Gothic standing clog. And we definitely need a beautiful clog. 
in black again. It's not really black though, but hey. I don't know why we have a clock there. It reminds me of Stranger Things. If anyone has seen the last Stranger Things um, 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 season. Do we have here? Ooh! Vecna's getting me now. <gasps> yes! I'll hail the dodo. Where do we put the dodo? Um, we put our lord and savior the dodo. Oh, we can't really, really see that above the clog. Mm, can we get rid of the, f the, the pictures of these people? I don't like them. It's our lord and savior the dodo. Otherwise, boring people. Tables. A chess table. Mm -hmm. Card game table. Gobstone table. Quidditch pitch table. How would these look like? Mm, I like that. Put it down. I'm making a dodo shrine, yes. Seating. Not unlocked yet. Statues. We had that, right? Oh, seasonal. That's cool. Hmm, I wonder what they will add into Deke the game. Will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Can you tell me a bit more about Deke? He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have, and seems to know it's every nook, cranny, and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready. But again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. We've charms in place to enforce that. Yeah, yeah. Would I would never do anything that harms the magic. rules. But the room of requirement has its own rules. May his gluck look never for sign. Unless it's an arc, then he can shut the heck up. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Oh, Thank I'm pretty you. sure Good I will luck. get to kill a couple of dodos tomorrow again. In case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Gonna be good fun. So, um... With the main quest in... Oh, okay, I see. You can fast travel here. And she has another side mission for me. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. The hell? Hello. How First, are you doing? You'll need to gather some moonstone. I have moonstone. You can moonstone. acquire it by vanishing items here in the room of requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. I think I have another, like one hundred twenty or something. Read mail. Come and see me as soon as you can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip to the ministry. Well, hoping your time has been more fruitful than If mine. it has been unproductive, why you need me? I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. I did already. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? I... I... I would like to teach you. Wingardium Leviosa. Ooh. It can be used to levitate objects for a short time. Once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do see me after class. I don't know why Professor Garlic wants to teach me Wingardium Leviosa because we know how to Wingardium Leviosa, but hey, you know, Professor Garlic, I come. I Here I am. Hmm. Okay, um, floor it decorations. Wait, how do I do that again? Oh, yeah, uh, that here, right? 
Oh yeah, I got new stuff. Nice. I got a rug. We, I got a couple of rugs. Mhm. Mm It's not that great, but it will do. It will it will do here at the beginning here. I can change the color though. This isn't black. This is also not white. Ah, I see. Just twitch things. Just twitch being weird again. So, decorations. Oh, well, that's pretty. Gothic standing light. Mm -hmm. Can, like... Why can't I put anything here? That's a bit unfortunate, I have to admit. Hmm... Maybe things. here then. You should be proud of all the potions you brewed. Change color again. Let me put another one right here. Beautiful. So wall decorations. I don't want these people on my wall. <laughs> What the heck is that? A painting of a nurse leaning over a cradle. Mm. A mirror? A mirror. Um. Deke hasn't seen this many plants here before. Mm. Let's put that there. Well, that's a bit wonky. Uh, my room can be a bit wonky. Uh, I really need stuff on the wall. I don't want like weird pictures of people on the wall. What is he holding? A bowling ball? Oh my god, this is huge. I could put a couple more dodos on the wall. Put those things here. There one. And there one. Because I like symmetry. Good work. Shall we move on? Absolutely. I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. Okay. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Self-grown garlic. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize it. Um, is it then? Oh no. Confused. Which one is it? That is the view, so. Akio. Ringo. Peliamos, that's Incendio. Eh? Oh, it's dead. Change color. Oh! Oh, I see. Well, that's nice. I, I did change the color of that, right? Or was that like that already? Oops. 
Oh. Ooh. But it's unavailable, unfortunately. Just the size of an item. You, you look, hey. I need to change that back now. No, 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 not the wall, man. God damn it. You should be proud of all the potions brewed. Oh, that's cute. That's kind of cool. And now the side, uh, the color. Nicely done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Yeah, I agree. The um, like the, the the details are amazing on all the models. Also, the balcony or the floor of the room. I want to also the floor. Oh, nice, finally. What are these fishies? Mm, I think I like that. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance. Don't you think? Deke, would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. What Professor doing, Weasley Deke? showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Uh, sure, Deke. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? A cool mo moonlit ambience. I'd like something natural and earthy. I focus best in a room that is dark and mysterious. We, we take that here. Mm, I'd like the room to feel mysterious and eerie. As if I'm in the forbidden forest, surrounded by shadows. Oh, sounds perfect. The slither enemy is showing her. Dark. Mm. Quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, half a power is easily the best common room. Surprise me. Candy is the candy. itself to your knees. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spell crafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. She winged at me. Have you seen that? Deke you would have, you would have, I know. Many plants here before. Can I get rid of that, by the way? Change color, apply. No, no, no. Oh. I see. Mm. I get that, yeah. Hmm... How do I get rid of these? Disable snapping? Oh, that's nice. Oh, okay, that's cool. Chris, thank you for the hydrate.
I don't know. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Let's see uh, how the natural one looks like look then. Most appeals to you. I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy, as though I'm outdoors. Hmm, oh, sounds perfect. Oh, that is the one that it was in already, by the looks of it. Hmm. Hmm. And I'd the like moonlit one? About changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I want the room to feel like I'm outdoors. I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Oh, sounds perfect. Hmm. I don't know, they're like... Very dark. I think I'd I... I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Is that all? Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I like darkness. I thought the dark and mysterious one was more like, like more like a cozy dark though, I have to admit. This if one I'm looks so forest, cool. Surrounded by shadows. Oh, sounds perfect. It's very greenish though. Ah. I can't find the video where I watched all four rooms probably claimed. I don't think I'm a big fan of either Nothing of them. To identify, for now at least. But we keep with that for now. So Wigan Well potions, didn't the seeds can be purchased at the magical needle you can be worn pods of me size. I cannot believe how many beasts you have here. Ah, I see. Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Yeah, absolutely. I think so too. Um, my first potion. So, um, let me see. We are... Not doing Professor Fix one. Professor Sharp, acquire and use a focus potion. Oh wait, we wanted to go to Professor Garlic. Oh, Leviosa, something different from Wingardium Leviosa. Red. Hmm. Dana, you play with magic now. You were you wasn't gonna tell your buddy. I can. You had these abilities. I can. Hello. Um. Astronomy Tower, acquire and use. Wait, what? Uh, I thought... Wait, what? Okay, and how are you doing? Acquire and use a venomous tentacular. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, where do I do that? Um... I am confused. Look at that PlayStation 5 back there. I have mine standing as well. Nice, 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 nice. So the one was honestly my least favorite. Everything was just dark and stone. Felt kind of moldy, to be honest. Griffin was just boring, red and boring. Ravenclaw was kind of cool. Lots of marble. Big areas with massive carpets and renaissance-looking furniture. But half a pub with all the brightness, light, wood and plants. Was by far my favorite. Yeah, I have to admit, look why Slytherin is definitely my least favorite as well. In, in general, I haven't seen the ones in the game yet, the other ones, but um, in general, it's definitely 
not my kind of thing. Room racing event? Secret room. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I need to get out here first. Wants me to field test a venomous tentacular and a mandrag. Should I need any seeds or plants? I can visit dogweed and death cap. My fear guy will not guide me through this assignment, but my map could still prove useful. Okay, then let's go to Dogweed and Death Cab. I think that is in Hog's Mead. I guess. Ruin Pack. Alright, oh, yeah, that's the. Is it here? No, oh, that's the Magic Neep. Livernus. Um. Uh, where are we getting the potions? Uh, the seeds. Lower Hawksfield. Uh There was a no. I'm confused. Hmm. Also a bit confused why I don't see the side quests. <laughs> right, the map out of forest bridge and candles. Oh yeah. Ghost of our love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe Maybe I could do that. Maybe I need to get out of here to have it shown. Okay, we click quickly. We quickly go to Hogsmeade. The username made it legit. Acquire and use a focus potion. Acquire maximum endurance potion and use them simultaneously. Focus potion. Um, that is a endurance potion that I have here. Invisibility, mandrake, Chinese dropping, venomous tentacula. That is something I have. Maxima potion, focus potion. I need to purchase the recipe for focus potion from J. Pippin's potion. We're gonna do that after I come back from uh, the you know pee time. So, we need a focus potion. That means I need to purchase something. Um, and we purchase it here. Oh, yeah, right. Left from me, right? Revelia. Um. I hear something. Uh. Huh. Hello there. Hello. In the market for potions, are we? Mm. What can I do for you today? So, focus potion recipe. A wise decision. Thank you. Um, I also need that here. Mm. X tongue juice, lace bean flies. Does he like also sell those leaves? Doesn't look like it. Ooh, that looks good. That looks nice. A tense cloak. No, that needs to go. Okay, okay. Oh, nice. Decrease damage taken from dark box. Ooh. That goes. Mm. I guess that goes. Nice. Nice. Mm. That goes. We keep these. Alright, alright. Man, they know. For the again. night, get ready. Well Do drink about 10 to 20 liters of water. 
Half a pub and Ravenclaw definitely have the best rooms. Uh, so what do we have to do? Acquire and use a focus potion. Or can I, like, can I, like, immediately what can I do for you today? buy a focus potion from you? Focus potion, 500. Hmm. Uh, it's quite a lot. Oh, come on. A wise decision. Thank so, you. um, endurance potion, maxima potion, focus potion. <laughs> now, maxima and endurance potion. Use simultaneously. We have an endurance potion. We have a maxima. No, we don't have a maxima potion, but we need. Oh yeah, I got the recipe for that, right? I need to brew one. Here you found a bit of treasure in the forest. It was never one for adventure, my friend. Right. Um. 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 Hmm. An abandoned old building in Hogsmeade. Is that like the hut, maybe? What is that? Oh, here I do get stuff. Oh, I see. Okay. Um, Hogwarts map. Is that the room of requirements? Yeah, it is. So. Take things. You should be proud of all the So what did I have to do? The maxima? Yeah. Have one endurance, we need to do the maxima. Um mm, maxima. No, we need to wait 30 seconds. And then we use them at the same time. And then I get something really cool. I I hope. But you know what? We um should upgrade our gear. Face wear. Beautiful. That is nice. These also look pretty sharp. Headwear. Um let me please get rid of the Glasses, um, it's level 21, but nice, nice, nice. Mm -hmm. Nope. New outfit, nope. Okay. Alright, so I have a Maxima Potion and I have one Endurous Potion. So, use and that and use. Excellent. There we go. Attend Potion class during the day. I look a bit stoned. I do look a bit stoned in here. My outfit looks like a too long sweater. It does a bit, yes. Bevelio. I agree. I think I should actually, maybe, look into a new cloak. No, 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 we know these. Hell no. So like any awesome black cool looking cloak. Dirty, dirty, dirty. Posh, posh. Nah. Dirty, posh, posh. 
posh pirate posh i think we yeah we just stick with that here or well, maybe just with the no we stick with that i could have a look at the ch challenges maybe Claim reward, what is that? Hmm, doesn't look mad like my kind of thing. Combat. Hmm, dragon high protectors cloak cloak. Hmm. A helmet, nice. Definitely what I want. What didn't claim that yet? Nah, I think these things aren't really for me. There are some really cool clothing options pretty early on. I feel you would love the dark magic one. Absolutely. I, I would love that, yes. I would definitely love that. Revenia. I sort of tried to hold myself back a bit from exploring so far. I mean, we did explore quite a bit, but I just noticed that there are so many things that I just can't open. Which makes it a bit sad for me. say one thing about Hogwarts, yeah? Way too many stairs. Oops. On the other hand, 68 questions sound like it could actually be a decent test for once and not like those shitty ones where every question has four answers that are extremely obviously weighted towards the house. That's true. You're very right about that. I like um, personality tests that have good questions, to be honest. Okay, nothing here. Okay, what are we doing today? coming along uh great i hope you're going to teach me more now your spirit animal is a sea turtle well i completed your assignments professor that Good. sounds cute you should be ready to learn to pulso let's see what you can do I need fucking jalapenos. Let your mind wander. I can offer you an onion. You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, and I think you should. Um. Oh, no, no, no. What was you? I for you, so. Uh. Repulso, Akio, Repulso. Fair 
suggest not to go flinging your classmates about the hall. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spellcasting. Um, it's a four spell that pushes enemies and objects away from the caster. Well, okay, repetition nice. can be an excellent teacher. Nice, nice, nice. Overall calm and collected down to earth. Yeah, that sounds fair enough. Kind of slow and out of place when I'm uncomfortable, but extremely nimble and well versed when I'm in my element. I'm interested now. <laughs> sounds intriguing. The map portrays a forest, bridge, and canals. Mm. Acquire and use a venomous tentacula. I think we have one. That's that here, right? Ooh! Hello. Acquire and use a mandrake or multiple enemies and simultaneously. Simultaneously what? Acquired by mandrake sees a dogweed and death cap. Oh, enemy. Oh, simultaneously, generally. Oh, yeah, I got it. I got it. Mmm. Hog's mead. Um, it's up here, right there. We need to go here. We travel here. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? It doesn't, nope. Revenia. It doesn't. Hogsmeade is the very best. I would move here instantly. I would move here forever. Pew. Um, 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 let's see. There's another flame page. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I know this is not the way, but it's kind of the way. Whoops. Oh, yeah, right. You guys. Mm. Hello. Rebellion. What do we have here? Some sickles. Oh. Watch yourself. Where's the page? There we go. This large tree with winding branches supports the shop dogweed and death cap. You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Scaring all the goblins away. Mm-hmm. That's me. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Mm. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you don't okay. knock the mandrakes. Madam Green. Oh, wasn't the constant demand for antidotes. I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little... What's the accent? I believe it's Scottish, right? Curses. And well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> or is it Irish? Knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead and I'm in no mood for a clear up. When you have the deer as spirit animal, you are highly sensitive and have a strong intuition. 
By affinity with this anima, you have the power to deal with challenges with grace. You master the art of being both determined and gentle in your approach. The snake anima meaning is powerful, connected to life force of primal energy. In many cultures, it is rever re revered as a powerful totem representing the source of life. When the snake spirit animal appears in your life, it likely means that healing opportunities change important transitions and increased energy are manifesting. Um, well, Neko, you have, you know, a Slytherin as your soulmate, so maybe that is the sign of the snake. Someone died here. Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. Now then, how may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. Mm. What do you have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? So I need to, um... Purchase that. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Hmm. Expensive. You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Scaring all the goblins away. But your things will be safe with me until they're sold. Then you'll have to make do with money. Do we grow them or? I think I try to grow my own mandrakes. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. I think I give it a go. So we go back to Hogwarts to the room of requirements and travel there. And then we're gonna see. So, room of requirement be nice on me. I cannot believe how many beasts you have here. Inspect empty pod. I can go and 10 minutes. I believe I could make another one, right? Apology. We can make another potting table, right? Oops. Kinda. Dig thing. And then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing oh. charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Oh, I like that. That's cute. So I should be able to make another one at the same time, right? Yeah. Oh. So that is two in ten minutes. I can live with that. Um, Defendo, he said. Defendo, we do that. Where is he again? He is. No way, that is the main quest. Trek quest. Uh, no. Hello? Hmm. I want that here. Acquire and use an invisibility potion. Acquire and use a thunderbolt potion against enemies. Say, okay, okay. So, um, Thunderbrew is something I need to unlock. Mm, damn. This is all so expensive just for Defendo. But hey, we can do that. Troll, troll boogies. 
Dr. Wood. <sighs> I need to go back to Hogsmeade. The internet test rabbit hole. Oh, I have fallen a couple of times for that one. I know the feeling. I know what you mean, Billeth. Don't, you will only do the shitty ones. Hogsmeade, here I come. Revelio. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Hmm. It's two thousand in total. Oh, Let's go. Decision. Thank you. Fun lab was one thousand. Damn. The invisibility is five hundred. Invisibility is five hundred. I hope to see you again. Mm. Shrivelic fruit. Can I? No. What can I do for you today? Do you have a shrivelic fruit? You have the tongue. You have the boogies. A wise decision. Let me get Thank two. You. I think I've seen these as well. I hope to see you again. Not grass sprig and shrivelic fruit. Maybe we get them up. Here you found the And the lady here. The weird lady. It was never one for adventure myself. You want to know what pizza you are? Um Probably spinach garlic. Cuz I like spinach and garlic. Revelia. Something is here. The savvy traveler knows that some water wells may have more to offer than this relatively innocuous water well in the village of Hogsmeade. I see a chest. I want the chest. Ah, it's that chest. It is that kind of chest. I really hope I learn that fast enough. I need my money. Oh no. Um. 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 Wait. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Vanishes items, returns moonstones from cast within the room. Ah, I see. So that is really just room of requirement stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I did the qu the quiz. Guess what pizza you got? Uh, what what pizza did you get? Like pineapple, Hawaiian, your pepperoni. Revelia. You are a Hawaiian. Nice, nice, nice. I don't know why people don't like pineapple on pizza. So good. It is good. I like them both separately, but not the combination. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelio. 
So just a minute. Well, what say we show you some of what's I... No, that's not what I hope to find you. Hmm. I know I purchased. Oh, oh I'm running out of money. Yeah. A wise purchase. I can tell uh, you that's far. not what I wanted to get. Um. Lumos. Where could that be? A chimney on the ground. We're gonna. We're gonna see. Hmm. Where could the chimney be? Oh, awesome! Two sickles. Oh, maybe up there. Actually, maybe up there. How do I get there? Oh, well, we could fly there. No, I want pizza too, yeah. Same, Neko. Same. The proprietor of this abandoned shop is said to have used a shrinking charm to aid in storing his inventory. However, a slight miscalculation ended up for all intents and purposes vanishing it. Oh, here's another one. Where would that one be? Lumos. That is a nice wall. That is a nice wall. I hope I can have some pizza on Tuesday again. I got all my... My toes and fingers crossed for that. Oh, hello. Are you the one? Hey. Come here. Come here, you little moth. Are you the one that belongs in here? You are. Alright. Um, I wanted to get up there, though. I know I can fly, but I don't want to fly. Revelia. This pretty much, by the way, looks like um, when, you know, Mark, his wife, and me hiked on the old man of store when we were uh, in the UK for two gigs and, you know, did go and see Scotland for a week. Very beautiful any more cozy than Hogsmeade. area. But it's literally how it looks like. Like, lots of sheep freely roaming. The area. Ooh. That's cool. Um, um, where? Hello. Are you one with an eye? Yes, you are. There you are. That's what I wanted. Um,. Am I able to lead you down here without... Yeah, I am. Nice. Sweet. So, um... Is there like another bee supply shop? Another one where I can buy. Hmm, maybe that here. And maybe I can buy stuff over here. That is an O. Okay. I thought it maybe would have been a page. It is not. We are too busy. Thinking of how to get the secret items in the video game. <laughs> that we never think about why they're there to begin with. 
Fair enough, yes. Whoops. I can see myself in that. I can definitely see myself in that, but that is a page. That is a page. Where is it now? There. MTJ! Hello! Your first raid to me. Shout out to you guys! The MTJ just actually started streaming. And I think we should all follow him. And support that. How are you doing? How was your... Was it your second stream? I saw you stream yesterday. I wanted to space out every letter, but I decided that halfway through the word and was too lazy to turn back. The first one was a mess, but it was the one yesterday, right? Pavelio. Did you enjoy yourself today, though? Oh, it's you! What a pleasant surprise! Yeah, nice. Ah, uh, yes, here's exactly what I want. Shrivelic fruit. We get now, both of them. I think it was that here. Yes. Oh, look, and they also have the mellow sweet leaves. We need that, too. Grow fluke sweet. Not grass. Mellow sweet seed. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Mm. No one can say I don't Did you manage to get the mic and sound sorted? Yes, nice. Revelia. Are you making a smooth transition to bed? Ha. Oops. Oh, yeah, right. I cannot use the broom and hawk's mead. Right, right, right. Um Revelia. Nothing here. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Where am I? We go here because I didn't unlock that yet. And there are also enemies that hopefully can give me some money. It's a wolf. Oh fuck. Nice. Um. What about the heart attack? Well, well, um, we said while well, playing this wonderful game here, I won't scare people with raid sounds or, you know, the nude nudes and alerts and, you know, the casual stuff. What is that? Oh! I found eggs. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Revelio. Hmm, what is that? Okay. A blog. Three blocks. Can I like set them on fire? Let the use of them. Do need to put Rebellion. something in them? Mm. Or maybe Lumos. Do I guide you guys there? Are you following me when I do live? Yes, you do. Okay, one in here. Yeah. Mhm. Mm
You're going to bed now? You're... What? Well, come in. These Merlin trials won't get the best of me. What is more refreshing than a good night's sleep? Good night. I hope you all have a good time. Billith, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for the good talks. And revealing that you are a pepperoni pizza. I appreciate that. If you like, you know where to find Neko and me tomorrow. Take care. Sleep very well. I hope it's going to be the best sleep of your life. You are indeed a pepperoni pizza. Okay. Thank you, Billith. Take care. Did I not see a page flying around here? Or is that an owl? I think it's an owl. There's no telling what lies in wait for me in there. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Revelia. <laughs> um, well. West Forbidden Forest. Yeah, it's like deep in, in the Forbidden Forest. If I do one more of them. I would be able to upgrade my inventory, I believe. Oh, but you know what? We also should... Go and check our uh, plants that we are growing right now. The flu flames. We should check our plants. Hello. One mandrake. Two mandrake. Um. So, I do have. I need to brew an invisibility potion. Invisibility. Um, maybe all, we also put down another potion area. Um, potion. There. Oh. Thank you. So, and a thunder brew potion. Maxima Thunder Brew. There we go. If this was a Ubisoft or EA game, you could buy Plant Growth Enhancer for the small price of 5.99 euros to make grow two minutes instead of ten. Yes. Indeed. So we're using the invisibility potion. And then we need to find enemies. Can I grow another one? Yeah, let me do that. Two minutes seems reasonable. Identify gear. <laughs> 
think that generally stops it, yeah. So, we have one. I'm waiting for that one as well, I guess. Just 30 seconds. Just, you know, what are 30 seconds? The sleeping potion has a pretty good effect on you. Good night from you as well, Mai. Thank you so much for joining us. Have a wonderful sleep. If you like, Ark is on tomorrow with Neko. Um, we, uh, or Neko actually did, you know, set the server back to normal stats. So tomorrow is going to be very interesting. If you like, join us. Um, I didn't uh, make any Felix uh, Felices yet. No, I didn't. No lag for me so far. So I need to use that on enemies now. World map. I wanted to go there. Um, is this part of the Forbidden Forest? Um, I go here. We go here. Okay. How nice to see you, my young friend. And the potion is that here. Thunder root creates a storm around the drinker, which will stun and damage nearby enemies. Okay. Just don't want to accidentally use it though. Because I will. I know myself. I know my luck. I don't have any, any luck. I didn't drink. This place has seen better days. Any potions for that? Revelio. Selling items would be nice as well, you know, like selling ingredients that I don't need. Absolutely adore the environment design. Rebellion. Very, very beautiful. Is that the at the train station maybe? Could be. oh yeah it is. It is, judging by the mini map. Oh, come on. Hello? No? Okay. Well then, if you don't want to, that's okay with me. Hawksmead Valley. Rebellion. Ah, this is cute. And I guess I already know what we have to do on this trial. I know a Merlin trial when I see one. Yes. That is five, six, seven, eight. Revelia. Confringo. Nine. That's that. Hmm. Settled. Nice. I was watching another streamer earlier today and really noticed how good the sound design is as well. The higher tier spells sound incredibly special with multiple enemies around. I think it's one of the most beautifully designed games I've ever played. So yeah, definitely agree on the sound as well. 
Um, is it is it here? Gear trade recipe reward? No. I'll definitely play it at some point, but I have so other stuff before that. Yeah, I, I gotcha, I gotcha, I know. My backlog is killing me too. That it is. Sweet. So, ten more trials. Oh, there are a couple of more around. Start a Need for Speed Unbound last week. Nice. How are you enjoying yourself? Got back into Elden Ring again. That's good. How do I get up there? I could use the broom. I don't want to use the broom though. I want to get up there. By foot. Maybe. What the heck is that? Oh, uh, wait. Um, creates a storm around the drink which will stun any of our enemies. I'm going to... Yes. There we go. Okay, cool. That's it. That's it. Rebellion. Your viewer demanded that you would read a 20 page document you found in the game. So we're going to learn Defindo now. And I'm still not. Nah, you know. Fuck that. Oh. Oh. Can I, like, drop down here and be like, Oop. There we go. Hogsmeade, here I come. Um... Is this Hogsmeade? No, this isn't... It's like a... This is like a village, right? We're not in Hogsmeade, are we? Oh, we are! Oh, we are! No, we're like... We're like here, right? Need for speed is pretty good, but tough. I definitely need to practice drifting, but I think I built my car wrong for that. So I'm losing out on quite a bit of stuff when I skip drift events and I can feel a bit dull at times. Um, you basically just drive from event to event and, and in typically EA fashion. The open world is full of arbitrary shit to collect that has no purpose. Yeah, that sounds like Need for Speed Heat too. Yep. Yep. Revelio. Yep, yep, yep. Likely left behind by a Hogwarts student visiting Hogsmeade, these enchanted confections hop around like real frogs and each comes with a collectible card featuring a famous witch or wizard. Oh yeah. Um... Defendu. No, wait. Um, 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 um. I was in mood for a racing game. My last one was Motor Storm Pacific Rift that came together with my Imagine PlayStation 3 and reviews for Unknown were good, so I took the opportunity. Power. As long as you enjoyed, I um, have to admit, I, I also weirdly. Really, weirdly loved Need for Speed Heat and spent a good amount of time with it. And you know, Neko and me actually did together. I wouldn't have thought that um, a new Need for Speed would, you know, intrigue me so much. Q 
shit. No, was it two pinches of Angelica? The next stream, the stories are good to be honest. I want to do more, but did not expect that it would be so much reading in the game. Hello. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. I heard him talking about taking responsibility. Ooh, finally won a new TV next week. Nice. And a lot of graffiti art stuff during the races adds a nice unique touch. Nice, nice, nice. Good morning, Quest. It's not morning yet. Unless you are somewhere in uh, Japan. Professor Sharp was annoyed, but we sorted it out. No harm. Cheers to that. Oh. He probably had a good nice, chuckle nice, after nice. he left. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Did you Best play Minish be Cap before? Next time we talk, I promise. Fewer explosions. Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either oh, way, but you... Oh, I see. So it was your first time playing. I want to make sure you're well prepared. I love Talent the marketplace. And are a potent like the markets and it would be a shame to Spend so many waste. hours just walking you, around as a kid. Don't let it go to your head. No. It still has scarred. Oh, fare, I see. Defendo. One nice. Ready. Very sure you will enjoy that. Focus. Very, very Defender sure about that. Dangerous if you're not paying attention. How much reading are you doing in your magic at school? Eh, mm. Not that much. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defendo. I would. Where is it? Here. Um. Once again, in the classroom, for your sake and that of everyone else. Okay. Sweet. Revelio. It's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Seriously, Minish Cap is one of the best sellers I've ever played. It's a very hype for game I once met right Golden Sun and Fire Emblem though. I highly recommend it. I can definitely recommend Minish Cap as well. Yeah, if you if you are if you never played that before, guys, give it a go. Revelio. Minish Cap is indeed one of the best seller games out there. You've never been uh, getting stuck in a dungeon. Oh, nice. Maybe you're just clever, Quest. Maybe you're just very clever. I need to use a mandrake on multiple en enemies simultaneously. How many mandrakes do I have? Two. Minish Cap was very logical. Mm, where do we go? Where do we go? We go... We go... I don't even know. We go here. Wolf! How is Silverhair Babe doing Call of Dana must know? The Silverhair cult is doing good. We're doing well. How are you, Wolf? Did Dana order Octopus Traveler 2 yet? Or is Dana an enemy of Square Enix? I I pre-ordered everything. I the PlayStation 4, the PlayStation 5, and the Switch version. School without reading, imagine how stupid that generation would be. Oh, wait, I don't need to imagine in this day and age. Uh, 
We have enemies here. Oh no, that would be enough. Where's the other one? Yo, get both of them on me now. Come on. Come on. Don't know how to use it, to be honest. Ouch. Nice. Okay, that worked. Nice. Oh. It's done yet. <sighs> Shame you're so foul. Nice, nice, nice. Um, 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 um. So. Is that another Merlin troll? It is. And we have Herbology Cross. What do you have in store for me this time? Oh. Best five Zeldas in order. Ocarina, Brother War, Minish Cap, Scarlet Sword, and Link's Awakening. This is not up for debate. 100% factual and set in stone. But what about Wind Waker? Rebellion. Yeah. Confringo. Rebellion. Ah. What about Wind Waker? The beast is safer now. Hmm. No, I'm far away from that anyway. Um, then we go in a, a tent. Class. It's one of the last things for today. And learn a new spell. What are you up to now? Um. So, guys, Professor Garlic, you can advance time by accessing the map and pressing R two. Uh, R three, R three. Wait here. Yes, I do. Where is she? There she is. I think our our herbology teacher looks even younger than us. Oh, hello. How wonderful to see you again. Hmm. Dear Professor Garlic, how very thoughtful of you and to remember that strawberries are my favorite. They are as sweet as can be. It's no wonder muggles love them so much. Everything you cultivate seems to be of such high quality, from bitterroot to berries. I do hope that my darling niece can learn the skill whilst Anya under your tutelage. Leonora so adores you, as do all of your students, I'm sure. Warmest regards See always, Eleanor so Evelyn. Goodbye, the empty jade. You go into the bathroom and you get undressed and you draw what you see, see you and you are dreaded about it. That's how you find out about the gen. Yumi Legs! Thank you so much for the raid! Welcome in! How are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome! Yes, take care of the MTJ. Have a wonderful night, sleep well. I'm very happy you enjoyed your... stream. Yumi! How you doing? And shout out to you! Thank you for the raid! Hi. How are you doing? I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. Okay, then. Let's go. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezeboard. And we go down. 
I am absolutely loving the game. It's my fourth stream now. And my fourth time playing, so I'm like around 15 hours, I believe. Maybe. No, wait. No, fourth. Uh, so around. Yeah. Nah, it's not it's not it's not more than sixteen. Maybe fourteen, fifteen hours in I'm I'm still absolutely stunned. I just got the broom actually, so well, I got the broom at the beginning of the stream and I'm I'm absolutely Ah I love it. I'm absolutely enjoying it. This is my childhood dream coming true. Well thank you for the hydrate. Yeah, this is absolutely my my childhood dream coming true. Levitate and move objects, controls position with your movement, and... Okay, okay, maybe... Hmm. Are you playing as well? And what house are you? That's, that's the important question. I have to go to bed early, gonna go to... Oh no, the battery. Gonna go to Ikea and get a new window lamp needed for Octopath Traveler 2 playthrough upstairs in the room. You don't play PlayStation 5 games downstairs. That is for the Switch. Very important. Around 30%. I, I, I Side missions are the best, right? Who needs the main quests? Who does need the main quests? When you can do the side missions. The only thing that is keeping me from doing more and more and more side missions is... You know, all the chests and the locks and everything that I can reach yet because I know that I will have to maintain all the main quests first to get all the spells. Who needs the main quest? I don't care about ancient magic and who I am. Like, let me explore. Been a while since we had a good Harry Potter game. The last one was Prison of Azkaban. Oh, Prison of Azkaban was amazing. Oh, I'm from Germany. I'm from Germany, you mean. And don't worry, I don't mind at all. Um, yeah, I, I, come on, yes, we can do that. Okay, so we learn being out on Leviosa. That's nice. Do we need to practice it? Which one is it? Leviosa. Was it like literally the same? Out for you. Oh, I see, I see. No, I don't see. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it. You're living in the United States, I see, I see. Where where are you from? Where um from in Europe? Romania, nice. I got you. Come on. Come on. Why does that never work on the first try? And then you figure out the first try should have worked because it was the right way to put it in. Okay, um... Okay. I will go to get some food, so I will look for a bit. Thank you so much for the look. I will actually have to uh, finish very soon, though, because it's getting late over here. Um, but thank you so much for the raids. I will give you a follow. Um, Just a quick question. What house are you? That's a very important one. It's a very important question. It was awesome meeting you guys, and I hope to see you soon. Take care, Yumi. And enjoy the Harry Potter shenanigans. Okay. So. Mm, so, yeah, we only have the main quest left at this point. I'm excited to show him the missing pages in the secret map chamber I found below the school. I suppose we're not talking about the Chamber of Secrets. I could eat some food now. 
I could eat some food now. But you know what? We could talk to him at least. And see what happens. Did we get any new gear? We did. Did get... Oh. No, it's not better. Okay. So, report to Fig. Mm. Neko, I'm hungry. Are you hungry too? You know I hate being left down. Vivelio. And you know I like a good cauldron cake. Yeah. What do you fancy? Is there a page around? Hmm. You're peckish. Revelia. Let's talk to him. Let's see what he wants. I was hoping to see you. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. I received a flurry of messages from Professor Black's house elf, Scrope. Scrope sent you messages? You mean yes, thank I you for the follow. Was hot too. He asked me to meet him and then told me to take the toast. Why would you want to take toast? To a cave under the lake. And that's where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location. Oh, that on sounds the map. good indeed. Believe it or not. Toast. It's a room. Toast. We have bubble. toast. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. Oh. We are... We are below the school again, by the looks of it. Pretty late for dinner. Indeed. Where are we? I'm a bit confused. The room is called the map chamber, by the way. And a portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor oh. Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them. And Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. Yeah, Peeves. Could just get a snack. Intrepid travelers, the both of you. Keep your wits about you. Oh, I see. To think. It was beneath us all this time. Order pizza bites and a whole bottle of wine. That could be me. Sounds like a good night. Hell yeah, I take that. I take pizza bites and a whole bottle of wine anytime. Hogsmeade. And over 
here, the Forbidden Forest. And, of course, Hogwarts. It's magnificent. He's Jesus. If only you were here to see this. Oh. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal, as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend. See now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability. The potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting Gringotts? Uh, what? I mean, uh, no. I do recall seeing the memory, but I don't remember all of the details. My friend Charles and I spoke of the port key and of trials we'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Charles is another of the Keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago, in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces Traces of a powerful, dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. Yeah. It looks is this familiar. a Rapunzel tower? Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. Twins! Hello. Um, do you know anything about it? You said that you know that tower. What can you tell me about it? Not much, I'm afraid. I've passed it dozens of times. It's north of Hogsmeade. My recollection is that it seems abandoned. Clearly, however, the tower conceals more than meets the eye. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, 
Be careful, and do not tell anyone where you're going. By the looks of it, they do keep the magical memory. They, you know, they they like get it like, like updated all the time. Ooh. Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. There was a nice short main quest. It's time you learned, Iglesias, the freezing spell. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Okay. What would that be? I'm curious on what we are going to do on Tuesday. I have to wait two days. Gonna have to wait two days. Pop balloons over Hogsmeade Station. Pop balloons around the Quidditch pitch. I guess I just... Yeah, with the broom, yeah. Grow and harvest fluxweed. Acquire all three common plants and use them simultaneously. Simultaneously, okay. Well, okay, cool. That's the first one we do. We will get glaciers and then we will get flipendo. That's really, really nice. The combat plans will be ours soon. Um, what do we have here? That is Arresto Momentum. Glaciers, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Flipendo. Uh, do I not like get something like Alohomora? Or oh, is that the one? Ah, yeah. Uh huh, uh huh. So that's an essential I didn't unlock yet. I see, I see, I see. I'm, I'm absolutely. I love growing wizard wheat. Of course, I do. That's my, that's my favorite thing in the world, growing wizard weed. Wasn't there like a, no, no. Here we go. I also may or may not sell the wizard weed 